Korea now ranks fifth in terms of global auto production, and it's number three in terms of auto export exports. Chimengo takes a look back on the last 60 years of the Korean auto industry and how companies like Hyundai and Kia have established themselves in the global market. It's been 60 years since Korea manufactured its first car, the Shibai, back in 1955. The car, whose name translates as New Start, was created by adding a Korean engine to a U.S. military jeep. Later in the 60s, the Korean government announced a series of measures to promote the auto industry. These efforts led to the establishment, in conjunction with foreign automakers, of three automobile companies, two of which are still in business, Hyundai and Kia Motors. With the technical assistance, Korea built its first modern assembly facilities and began assembling cars. Through continued collaborations with foreign car companies, Korea's first homegrown automobile, the Hyundai Pony, was built in 1975. Hyundai chalked up another first when it exported the Pony to South America in 1976. Then in the 80s, Korean automakers began focusing on developing mass production systems to build an export-oriented industry. And on January 20th, 1986, Hyundai entered the U.S. market with its Pony XL. It sold more than 168,000 cars, setting a record for selling the most cars in its first year of business. Three years later, on the back of its initial success in the export market, Hyundai began designing and producing vehicles with its own technology. Last year, overseas shipments of Korean vehicles stood at more than 3 million units, and the value of Korea's auto exports reached an all-time high of nearly 49 billion U.S. dollars. Hyundai and Kia Motors said Tuesday they had exported 100,000 vehicles for each of 17 car models last year. Now, as they pass the 60-year mark, Korean automakers are plugging into the latest trend and developing eco-friendly vehicles. Jim Young-gil, Arirang News.